Whoa, for today alone. <laughs> what's Shut what's up, that? is it? What's that? What is An that? hour and a half less than yesterday. My God, you need help. Daz, have you seen? My name is Tanya Moore, I'm a stand-up comedian, I act, I write, I present, and I have a dad called Noel. What was Tanya like as a child growing up? A piss. My dad's going through my phone in a bid to find out more about me, which could have been solved by a father-daughter day out, but here we are. Now, Tanya was a wonderful child. She was destiny, I didn't think she would be destiny for acting, but to me, she was always destiny for something. I don't call him my dad, I call him my son, because uh, Noel, I look after Noel. I've got no stretch marks from my son. Uh, he doesn't live with me. I'm not actually fiscally responsible for my son. I just have a son. Yo, here come a big thing at the dance, man. Can you hear me? Yo. Yeah, man. All right, then. Cool. Drop the rhythm and make me forward. Yeah. And um, if you need the subtitles for that, I will provide them in an email <laughs> <laughs> within seven working days. <laughs> Tanya, do you want to hand your phone over? I want something to clean this in case of COVID. You don't really grow up and you say, I really want a partner to be like my dad. And then you get to adult age and you're like, maybe not actually, maybe, <laughs> maybe you shouldn't. And then my dad does a lot of stuff that my partner actually does. And I'm like, I'm dating my fucking dad. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, your partner must be a very wonderful person. Very irritating, both of you. <laughs> He's not cancelling my career, not today. <laughs> What's what? What's up? <laughs> that one there. Raw tip in the <laughs> Bully screaming at each other. Gemma is wild. Ducker doesn't actually care. He's not upset. Did he just growl before he kissed her? <laughs> Did they bump the bump bits? Shut up. We were talking about uh, the show Married at First Sight. Oh, that idiot thing. Yes, good yeah. one. Do you watch idiot it? Thing. Once now, I just start watch it, but then I start stupidness. Why is it stupid? I couldn't be married at first sight. Because that's the that's the point of the show. Marry a stranger, who the who the, the the experts have put you together based upon your needs and, and some of your wants. Well, they haven't made my needs. If my needs, if they was to put me together, they wouldn't put me on there with that idiot girl. They put me on there with a multi-millionaire woman. No, but they wouldn't have you on the show, baby. Why? Because they haven't got a multi-millionaire woman. No, because they wouldn't. They don't. I don't think they've tackled polygamy yet. Who? <laughs> Tackle who? Happy birthday, and Jack. You want? Clever people. He can't spell Jamaican. He can't spell English. <laughs> We have a year happy birthday, year P P I. Do that. I know how we spell birthday at Jamaica. B I R D A. Are you Noel sitting there getting upset about the way something is spelled, knowing how you spelled my name? This is the scenario we're sitting in right now. That's a difference. <laughs> <laughs> That's Let a me hear this. This idiot try to spell like Jamaican. See. I, as a smart person, was extending your name so that it can be a one-off thing. Nobody else have it. Lily had the valley mm -hmm. and the valley. You know, that's like the seventh explanation you've given me. Is that all? What happened to the rising of the sun? Yeah, you're rising up the sun in, in the, the lilies. In the valley, of which the is of the lily of the valley. <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter with you? Yeah. Why did it have to be TH? Because it has to be different. It's a very Jamaican thing. It's different, isn't it? It's Tanya, but it's not Tanya. It's internationally, alternationally. Internationally, alternationally. Yeah. When I was in Jamaica, I was the only Noel. I came to England and within a space of about four days, I found seven. Did Damn. you ever celebrate Christmas when you were in Jamaica? Yeah. And you never sung any Christmas hymns? The first Noel, which was me. 
There was no other Noel from where I was born. I grew up being the only Noel in Trinityville, Maran, Bay, Coley Lot, all these places in Jamaica. There was only one Noel. The I'm first. taking Cavendish. He needs a five. Right. <laughs> he said the first Noel. That was me. That was me. Royal Muse. News. What do you think about Harry? Harry's got a book coming out called Spare. I got nothing against the Royals. If that's the way they were born, that's they were born into it. That's the way life is. But really, they don't mean nothing to me. I was Googling it though, because I was writing for a piece. And I do find it interesting that that's the, the, the title that he chose to use. What's the book really going to say? What's it? If he's in there complaining, I'm going to buy a book just so I can fry at him. Go and live in Tyler Perry's house and relax. Mm -mm. It's so tough. Well, you know that money you spent on that rip birthday party? Yeah. That would have bought me two houses. Bitch. Oh, wow. Did you just so... call him a bitch? <laughs> 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 that slid out! <laughs> No, but the money they spent on following these people around, yeah. right? Yeah, I was with you. I was with you up until the bitch. Other people, you know. Jesus Christ. You can't cry for rich people. What are they? Black, white, pink, purple, Chinese. I can't cry for them. Whoa, for today alone? <laughs> what? Shut what? up, is it? What's that? What is About an hour and a half less than yesterday. Basically, I've been on my phone for 10 hours and 20 minutes today. My God, you need help. I use my phone for all things. Yeah. Emails, work, social, yeah, phone no, calls. What the top thing she spent her time on is? Um, excuse me, sir. Uh, <laughs> this is a setup. <laughs> I need to watch the TV going to sleep. But because when Marlon sleeps and TV wakes him up, I have the phone under the covers. But then I fall asleep. It just rolls into the next series and it just stays on. So sometimes I wake up and I'm on like season 10. What's the third thing? Match Masters. Okay, that one's really bad. It's a game that I play and I'm obsessed by it. And, it's, and, and that one I need rehab for because I literally pull up outside my house and before I go in the house, for some reason, I need to play the game now. And then two hours later, I'm still in my car, I'll play in the game, right outside my house. <laughs> and what gets me is every time I see her playing this game, she's never won. Maybe I do I'm... win, thank you, sir. But why is it you never win when I'm around so I can... Maybe you're the omen, you're the bad luck. Whoa! <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> You, Jesus wept. Can we go back to search history on Google? <laughs> she spends 16, call it 17 hours a week playing this game to get her ass bus. When I, you're on set and you're in between situations, you play much more. I didn't. I sat and I had a good conversation with the man. When? On the way here in the car. Excuse me, sir. You were here earlier on, on WhatsApp. It's got a WhatsApp group, right? And they play dominoes together and they all talk together. Every morning they say good morning. It's the same nonsense. And he's the one in the group who's the celebrity because he's been on TV for 30 fucking seconds. No. This WhatsApp group is popping, I'm telling you. They all talk all day and they're the type of people that send them random weird videos to each other and they think it's hilarious. No. And I'm, do you know how I know why they think it's hilarious? Because he forwards them to me. That's because I wanted to get some real jokes. <laughs> the church? Yeah. This is something about church. Your online church. Do you want to come with me? No. Nope. Even if we go online? No. Nope. So after football, because we go football on a Sunday, after football, should we go to church, come back to mine, and then we'll have breakfast, and then we'll have church? No. Nope. Why don't you believe in God? I don't. I don't. I don't. It's just something that's just written by a man. I mean, you know, say this is a tree where Judas hung himself, you can't find that. This is a place where Jesus was buried, you can't find that. This is a place where the cross was, you can't find that. This is, you know, part of his life is missing out of the Bible and he came back. No. Nah. Then Henry VIII, he was like a gigolo or whatever. He just loved women, so every time he saw something he liked in a skirt, he wanted it. So he couldn't do it as a Roman Catholic, so he created the Church of England so that he could divorce. And if he couldn't divorce, he'd chop their heads off. And if his archbishop don't listen to him, he'd chop his head off and all. As long as he got it going his way. 
And to me, that's the foundation of both of those churches. I think you should be a history teacher. Life is how you make it. That's the way life is. Nobody makes it for you but yourself. It's true. Trust me. Plot twist, you die and the first thing you do is you end up at a bus stop and it's your soul and your mind. And they're like, where are we going? Jump on the bus, whichever direction you're standing, side of the road you're standing on. So if you're standing on this side and the bus is going to Lewisham, jump on it, you're going to Lewisham. The other side of the road's going to Peckham, you're going to Peckham. Yeah. Which one's heaven and which one's hell? Oh, good question. The new cross is the earth. Lewisham is downhill, so that's hell. And Peckham is uphill, so that heaven. Um... Shall we move on now? Shall we look at something else? What is, what is it about? It's a period tracking app. A who? <laughs> so it lets you know when you're ovulating or when you're due on or if anything's happening with your body and you can put information into it and it can tell you what the symptoms could possibly mean. So this lets you know I had a period. We're functioning. Oh, that's why you was at a voter on Saturday or Sunday, isn't it? When I found you, you was very out of order and rude. I'm trying to be English here. Yeah? If I'm Jamaican, I would say you to a damn fierce and out from sat there, come on and box you. I was talking about your outfit. Yeah, that's yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I said to him, because um, my dad thinks he can dress, he can't. I think that he looks nice because me and my siblings buy him nice clothes. Now, there, I can't say he can't dress. There are some times where he picks like a one-off item and I'm like, Dad, well done. You look good. Like I walked in today, you look fantastic. Today. That's what the ladies said. You look really nice. Look, <laughs> <laughs> look really nice today. And a man can use this for you know when his wife is going to be fiesty. Or when she's gonna have wow, a Wow, not for support, no? <laughs> no, nah, when she's gonna have um, more than just a headache as an excuse. Jesus, give me the strength. Yeah. And then up, up mm. here, he knows he knows when to buy our flowers because he knows that she's ready. That's it. Yeah. There's one visitor and her boyfriend. You're the one that's kissing him and he's hugging the camera, look. Yeah, because that's what he does. That's a part of our jokes. Oh my God. See, he's always looking at the camera. That's, that's Marl on his vein. Imagine a Jamaican man loving himself so much that everything's centered around him. God, no. And a Jamaican would have a pose with it. He's just looking at the camera. If you see like me now, I don't just look at camera. I'm just like, yo. Oh, me doing work out. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> sorry, we have multiple, <laughs> multiple evidence of him not supporting me. <laughs> I'm doing step, and this is after doing it for like 45 minutes. I thought if I put the camera on, I'd motivate myself not to stop. Okay. It didn't work, I just stopped anyway. Should I keep the camera off then? Oh, <laughs> uh, look at this, this is, this is, this is classic. Oh, no. look at the walk. You see, that's Jamaican for you. Look at the walk, look at the walk, look at the walk. You're stupid. You're stupid. Yes, please. Yeah, have it back. Thank yeah. you very much. That was quite fun, actually. Yeah, I was quite good. I like that. Mm. So it doesn't matter what tempo she's in or whatever mood she's in. She's always my baby. So there's nothing much you for me to it. learn about her, you know. So you saved it. I think I en I just enjoy watching his reaction actually, and I know my dad's at cantankerous stage. What can I do? Nothing. He's a lovely guy. He's a great guy. If you want to go out with him, you go for drinks, darts, dominoes. You'll have the best time of your life. You just have to listen to all of his stories. <laughs> I can't tell you one, but when I was no, you're right. We're, we're storied out today. 